the invasion. Tonight, Kettle Land Sydney Thorson shares how you can help those who left the war zone. We ended up packing uh, our most important belongings in less than an hour and headed out somewhere, really not knowing where. Um, all we knew is we needed to, you know, escape uh, from these tanks and rockets. That's what Calvin Jones was thinking after he and his wife heard the first explosions. This is a similar story to what many other refugees are facing. Well, it was really like stepping into a new life. I mean, you are leaving everything behind at that point. That's why Jones is encouraging South Dakotans to help during this time. Dream Design International, a development company in Rapid City, is matching up to $50,000 in the New Americans Funding Initiative. They're also helping launch Freedom's Haven, which could help thousands of Ukrainian refugees find jobs in South Dakota. We are fortunate to be blessed with the resources that we have, and uh, we cannot really stand on the sidelines and abuse the, those resources and not utilize them to help others. We're just, we're just stewards of those resources, and we got to utilize them to help other people. Sponsors for the initiative, like Dream Design International, hope to raise tens of thousands of dollars to not only bring Ukrainian refugees to South Dakota, but to a safe place. This was a win-win for South Dakota and for the Ukrainians. In Rapid City, Sydney Thorson, Kelloland News. And Calvin Jones will be performing soul music and stories from the Ukraine war this week in Rapid City and next week in Sioux Falls. We've included information for that and how you can donate to the cause under this story on Kelloland.com.